Hi, I'm Josh and today I'm going to show you how to make an Indian curry base gravy. If you've ever wondered how your local Indian makes great tasting meals in minutes, then don't go and I'll reveal their cooking secrets. Okay, for the base gravy you'll need 750 grams of chopped onions, one chopped carrot, 75 grams of chopped white cabbage, one green pepper, 50 grams of diced and peeled potatoes, one tablespoon of garlic, one teaspoon of ginger, one tablespoon of all-purpose seasoning, 150 millilitres of vegetable oil, and one tablespoon of coriander powder, one tablespoon of cumin powder, one tablespoon of turmeric powder, 50 grams of coconut block, one tablespoon of sugar, one tablespoon of garam masala, one tablespoon of tomato paste, 200 grams of tinned tomatoes, and two liters of water. You will need a pot that is able to hold at least four liters of liquid. To begin, add the oil, the onions, pepper, the carrots, the cabbage, garlic, and the ginger. And fire gently for 20 minutes, stirring occasionally until the onions soften. Now add the potatoes, water and sugar and then boil for an hour, stirring occasionally. Now they had softened, add the spices, tomato paste, chopped tomatoes, and coconut blocks, and bring back to the boil and cook for 15 minutes. When fully cooked, allow to cool for 15 minutes, then blend until smooth using a hand blender. cold water to bring up to 4 litres and then blend again to mix all the ingredients. Allow 
allowed to cool and then either place in a fridge or freeze in 250 milliliter portions. I store my base gravy in these plastic pots in the freezer, then either I get them out in advance to defrost or microwave them for three minutes when needed. In my next video, I'll show you how to make some of your favourite dishes using the base gravy to save time. Please remember to like and subscribe and check out this and other recipes on my website at thecurrykid.co.uk.